Vector databases are the way that large language models search through information. Traditional databases are what you're used to. You have a document and you have an organized set of keywords that reference this document. When you search these keywords, you pull up the document. This works if you have really structured data or you wanna go through that process of actually assigning document keywords, but that's not how our brains work. If I had a document about cats, I could search up the word cat or cat food, and this document would probably show up because I've ascribed the keyword cat to this document. But if I searched up something similar to cat, so for example, dog or pet, the document probably wouldn't show up unless I've actually gone and said that these are keywords that should make this document show up. You can say the same thing about memes or GIFs. For us, all of these things are related in our brain. So when we think about cats, we can pull all of these things up. But traditional databases don't work that way. So that's where vector databases come in because it's looking at comparing concepts. So the concept of cat to the concept of a tiger or a concept of a meme and seeing how similar they are.